here. Let me say it slowly for you. Set Yosaurus. Ah. Setiosaurus means whale lizard, and I am pretty big, aren't I? <laughs> I'm a herbivore, like other sauropods, such as Apotosaurus and Diplodocus. Sometimes being heavy has its advantages. Unlike other dinos, I'm really heavy. It's because my bones are solid, <laughs> not hollow. <laughs> I lived along what is now known as Europe. <laughs> Did you hear that? Hardly any other dinos can eat me, but you don't want to meet the ones who can. Well, gotta go find my herd. Safety in numbers, you know. <laughs> Goodbye! Hey there, come here. Closer, closer. Too close! Ah, that's better. My name is Dilophosaurus. That's Dilophosaurus. I live here in the early Jurassic period. That's 200 million years ago. Whoa, look at that. Two cicades. One, two. I love the number two. Dilophosaurus means two crested lizard. See, one, Two, two crests, ha! I'm a theropod. That means I run on two legs, two. And it also means that I eat meat. Two dinners to go. Yum and yummier. Hmm. I live in what is now known as Arizona in the USA. I am the great, 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 Great granddaddy of modern day birds. But I'm a lot bigger. In fact, I'm the biggest meat eater alive here in the Jurassic period. And here are my two favorite twos. My kids. What do you say we play two games of tag and find two snacks and pick two plants for mom? Great. See you tomorrow! Whoa! I'm Mashiachosaurus. You say it like this. ma shi a ka -saurus. And my name means vicious lizard. Whoa! The late Cretaceous period, about 68 million years ago, was a total blast. Yahoo! I'm a theropod, like the T-Rex, so I eat meat. But check these out. Okay, I look like I need to go to the dentist. But seriously, these teeth were made for fishing. Hey, why can't we all just get along? Because Mashiachosaurus needs to eat. So do fish. Yikes! Fish food, I mean. Mashiachosaurus are from what's now called Madagascar. And stay out! <sighs> Thrown out of a lake by a fish. How embarrassing. Don't they know I'm a theropod? Like a T-Rex? <coughs> Whoa there, Rex. Will it help to know that he's not much bigger than a dog? <coughs> I wasn't talking to you, T-Rex! But fish isn't the only thing I eat. Jackpot! 
Mm. Time for lunch. See you guys later. No! It's not sounding right. Come on. I thought you guys wanted to be in this band. Oh, hi. I'm Pina Kosaurus. Say it with me. Pina Co Saurus. That means plank lizard because of our armor plates. Welcome to the late Cretaceous period, 78 million years ago. This is my band. We don't have a name yet, but that's Ying, that's Yang, and I'm Pin. Wait! Not until I say go. We're ankylosaurs. That means we're armored dinos. We also have big clubs in our tails for defending ourselves. Or making music. No, no, no! I wasn't starting the song. I was showing everyone how I defend myself against a carnivorous dinosaur. <laughs> when our band goes on our first tour, we're gonna leave from what is now China. In fact, we're the best known dinosaurs from China. We'll soon be the best known dino band too. Oops! Very funny. These spikes and armor help us to defend ourselves, but they can make it tricky to get around. We're medium sized at five meters long. We're much longer than a golf cart, but we're only one meter high, same as a mailbox. Like other ankylosaurs, we have a beak, which helps us cut low growing plants. We're like dino lawnmowers. Hey, what a great name for our band. Let's show them what the dino lawnmowers are made of. So, enjoy the show. Oh, aren't they precious? Hi, I'm Plesiosaurus. You say that Plesiosaurus. My name needs near lizard, and this is the early Jurassic period 180 million years ago. I have to gather up the babies and get them to school. Okay, it's time for school, you three. Our four flippers let us move through the water as easily as flying through the air. It's our best defense against predators bigger than us here in the water. Oh my, now where do they go? And this is the other defense we have against predators. We blend into the underwater scenery. <laughs> Got you! I'm a medium-sized plesiosaurus, as you can see. I'm only slightly larger than a human being. Oh, and plesiosaurus are not actually dinosaurs. We're big reptiles who live in the water. The way you can tell us apart from dinosaurs is what our legs look like. Mine are springing like this, and dinosaur legs go up and down like a human's. Anyway, plesiosaurus eat lots of fish, and our teeth are mesh, so when we grab a fish, we never let go. Our fossils have been found in many places because a lot of the earth was covered with water in the Jurassic period. See? I got you to go to school after all. I think it's time for recess, don't you? Let's go to the top for some air. Bye! Welcome to the early Jurassic period. You haven't seen three of my herd around here, have you? My name is Scootalosaurus. That's Scootalosaurus, but you can call me Scoots. My friends and I like to hide from each other. My name means little shield lizard. My shield is made up of all these little armor plates. They help to defend me and hide me. I'm a bipedal herbivore, which means I eat plants and walk around on my two back legs, but I am top heavy. Now, where did those guys go? I'm from what is now Arizona in the United States of America. I have a beak and special teeth, which allows me to eat all these tasty plants. Oh no, not the Dilophosaurus again. Come here, you little morsel. Jump in my mouth. What? Where'd he go? That's better. I'm safer here with you, right? See, I'm just a little guy. 
I'm about the same size as you. Now, if I was my herd, where would I hide? Hmm? Hmm? Oh well, maybe if you come back later you'll see them. But you'll have to look closely. Bye! Ah! Oh, ha! It's the late Jurassic period. A hundred and fifty million years ago. I'm so deaf. Say it like this. So deaf. I'm a pterosaur. That's a flying reptile. But I don't know how to fly it. <laughs> if I'm ever gonna catch those bugs, I have to learn soon. See, I'm not a very big pterosaur. But I have a half a meter wingspan! Check it out! Oops! Sorry! <laughs> I don't have a big crest on my head like other tessels do. And it sure can get cold here. I know I can do it. I know I can do it. I know I can fly. Supersaurus, and welcome to my home here in the late Jurassic period 150 million years ago. My name means super lizard because I'm so big, one of the biggest dinos ever. You gonna eat those? Yes, Charlie, I'm going to eat those. We have to eat all day long. It's the only way we can grow this big. Uh, I feel faint, I'm wasting away. <laughs> I need to eat something. But right now, I have to find a pond or river so my herd can have a drink after we mow this field. Water, water, I need water. I'm 43 meters long and 16 meters high. That's super sized, all right. <sighs> so thirsty, I'm delirious. Mother? Is that you? No, Charlie. I'm not your mom. She's back there with the rest of the herd. My neck is really long, but I don't lift it up high as it's too heavy. But it's perfect for... pushing through the trees to find more food. Or... Hey! Water! Hey! Don't take it all! It's my turn! Come on! Move over! Don't worry, Charlie. There's plenty for everyone. I'm going to tell the herd I found water. We live in what is now Western Colorado in the USA. Hey, everyone. There's water in the conifer forest over there. You going to eat those? Hi, I'm Velociraptor. Yes, the famous Velociraptor. The Lhasa Raptor. It means speedy thief. See my long tail? It lets me run really fast. <sighs> but not for too long. Didn't know I had feathers, huh? I need them to keep me warm. Because, well, 85 million years ago, it sometimes got pretty cold around here. And where is here? It's what is now known as Northern China. I'm not very big either. If you compare me to my cousins like the T-Rex. But like them, I'm a meat eater and I walk on two legs. 
but I'm just about the size of a big turkey. <laughs> I hunt in a pack. In fact, this whole time my pack has been watching us. a day playing with your friends. Eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. Bye. Hi, everyone. I'm a woolly mammoth. You can call me Wooly. My name says it all. I'm big, I'm fuzzy, and I'm lost. I mean, really, how can I find my herd if everything is covered in snow? Welcome to the Ice Age. 100,000 years ago, I guess. Eep. Hey! What's the big deal? <laughs> my long shaggy hair and my thick layer of underwool keeps me dry and warm. So throwing snowballs won't do anything! Plus, I have special skin which oils up the hair to make me even warmer. Eep. Aha! I have an idea. Mm. I use my super long tusk to shovel the snow to uncover this yummy grass. How will I ever be able to eat it all by myself? Ha ha ha. I'm a little bigger than the biggest elephant, but my ears are much smaller than an elephant's. I come from the cold northern part of the world where scientists have found entire woolly mammoths, hair and everything, frozen in the ice. People usually get mixed up and think I'm a dinosaur, but I'm really an ice age animal. Eep! Okay, wise guy. <laughs> he got me all right, but at least he knows where the herd is. I thought you knew where they were. <laughs> <laughs> 